building using product structure right and you want to get along in all of my releases for this series and even more right so if you're joining us for the first time on my channel i'd encourage that you use the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my releases on this series and other um, releases and that you share this video to your colleagues that should get better in structural engineering straight into the business i want to show you how i design a g plus two that is the ground floor plus two plus building using product structure right let's get going Having received a document from the architect, right, and you want to understand what the structure, what the building entails, so that you can relate exactly and accurately with, with all that he had provided in his designs, right? So he had provided a series of documents and um, it contains all that I need to carry out my enterprise as a structural designer and your first assignment is to understand what he had in mind as his um, result of his imaginations or creativity so that you can actually flow along um, whatever it is that he had made right so the first assignment you have now is to understand the architecture right of which i did checking through i i found several drawings um more like the ground floor plan yeah the ground floor plan and um Checking through also, I found the first floor plan, right? Also, in that same document, I have the paint floor plan, right? Then also, I found out that we have the roof plan. So, this means that I'm having four um, floors and um, three stories if you do not understand what um, that means you would want to pay attention as we go on um, this will be reviewed in the lines of our modeling and application in the designs All right so i have the ground floor i have the first floor i have the pen floor and i have that of the roof that's four of them All right so but the stories the suspended floors that i have they're just Three. right so what to do with all this um, information that I've been provided and also I, I see that I have um, a section provided for different sections actually provided for me to relate with um, and the essence of this section provided um, by the architect is so that you can see some um, hidden details um, that are not reviewed at first insta instance um, in the plan or whatever elevations that you have right so i have a whole number of them putting all these things together i was able to provide an arrangement that um that qualifies arrangement that qualifies this for the support of this building structurally now if this is what i call the general arrangement drawing and the general arrangement drawing is simply um, a drawing that shows structural components or elements their positions their sizes their informations how that they can come together to produce um, a safe and stable structure and yet economical right so um, this drawing shows a whole lot of information of structural reinforced concrete elements right so i've been able to make out um, this general element drawing if you do not know how i came about this general element drawing you can please use one of my videos how to generate a general element drawing on my channel the link is in the description of this present video that you um seeing right now right do what you use very comprehensive and explanatory you can get along with that simply right so having produced a general element drawing for the ground floor for the first floor then i have for the pent floor then also for the roof now i have this also what next to do now is to begin my design attempt and um, that means i will need to apply or introduce the use of product structure at this point so before you talk about product structure you would have understood the architecture you'd have 
you related so well with all that the architect had provided for you as a structural engineer then you would provide a system of stability um, which is uh, a combination of several uh, structural elements with right positioning right sizes you know and right applications to ensure that um, you're not missing anything along the line and to provide a safe and stable structure all right so want to apply the product structure right now which i did after i was done with my general element drawing once again if you have not made attempts to study general element drawing or you you don't even know how to go about it or you you don't even know what i call that you can use my video on this channel the link is in the description of this present video you are seeing how to generate a general arrangement drawing 